which is, uh, has obviously reignited today following the result and we spoke you, to... You call it a debate, yeah? Well, it's an exchange of views. <laughs> it's, yeah? exchange it's an exchange of views. Of views. <laughs> uh, and, uh, you know, a former Labour MP, former colleague uh, of yours, uh, Laura, uh, Laura Pidcock, um, in County Durham was saying exactly the opposite, uh, which was that the party's message simply wasn't radical enough. Uh, it simply wasn't appealing to the working classes. Uh, it wasn't a programme that they would be attracted to. Well, um, why did she lose her seat then, herself, well, in 2019? Um, she stood on a programme of radical policies, all the things that she believes in and wanted to put forward, and she lost in Durham. Why? If it was so good, if it was so brilliant, if it was so appealing, why did she lose? I'm making the point, Peter, that this debate is <laughs> I'm still going you rhetorically. on. I mean, this debate is still going on. John McDonnell <laughs> earlier it, making it, the same point. Yeah. So, so, but, uh, it uh, but it's a point about perceptions. It is, it's a point party, about perceptions. That this party cannot learn from its defeats. It can't even learn from its victories. It can't even learn from its victories. We had four successive election defeats before Blair was elected in 1997. And then he won again. And then he won again after that. And since then, we've had another four election defeats. It's about time we learn both from our defeats and from our victories. Okay. Um, 